Hey, what's going on, everybody? Y'all know who it is. It's JJ. You know, we back at it like an egg. No rehab. You know, I'm addicted to give you guys advice. Oh, man, we're here picking up this car. I think we're somewhere back here. Um, I know it's been a while since I dropped the video. But, yeah, I was just getting my kids back prepared, ready for school and stuff like that. You know, doing the essentials and all that stuff, you know. But, yeah, we back. We're going to drop some videos and, uh... We're here picking up this Impala. I don't know exactly where it's at, but it's gotta be somewhere back here. Uh, it's 2000 Impala that I bought. Um, gotta be back here somewhere. I'll get y'all when we pull this start right up because I don't have a jump box. But I mean, I'm pretty sure somebody will let us use one if it's needed. But excuse me, but yeah, I was thinking about doing a course and it, everything courses, but I think I'm gonna just do like find some, I'm gonna just do like webinars, maybe like a monthly, you know, webinar or something like that. Maybe like twice a month webinar. Get like a little subscription base where I do like a webinar. Let me know in the comment section below. Should I do the course or should I do like, or should I just host like a monthly, a twice a month webinar? I think the webinar probably, in all honesty, probably be better just to host a webinar every month, you know, because every stuff changes and then with the webinar, I can answer more questions. Cause I know, I feel like when, when I just dropped the course, I feel like the course is just gonna get dropped. And then people are still gonna have a lot of questions. Impala needs to be sprayed off. 188,000 miles does have a dent right there, but I mean, what do you expect? Does need to be vacuumed out. Let's see. Okay, we having some ignition problems. Hopefully it's the right key. That's gotta be. Let's see. Maybe. Maybe it's just uh but let me check these fluids right quick. Keep that open. Just so I don't lock myself in. Just so I don't lock myself in. Okay, it's got oil. It's got duct tape on the cooling for. It's got coolant. Belts look a little rough. Window maybe works. Maybe doesn't. Let's. Keep jiggling this key in. See, maybe it's the right. Maybe if I just do like this and basically see if it works to the door, then I would know it's the right key or not. Yeah, it does work to the door, so it is the right key. It's just. I don't have no gas in there, but I don't know if that's because the gas had no it's there's low fuel, so it's very dirty in here. Well, it doesn't need to be vacuumed though. People let their stuff be really dirty. Yes, 
station. But I know it's one like right. It's one. So I'll check and see if the AC works. Surprisingly, the AC works. <laughs> I just gotta make sure this temperature hand works. It's very dirty in here, but the AC works. I guess the AC works. Make sure this temperature here is moving. I'm gonna go put some gas in here and see if the gas hands. Okay, temperature hands moving. Okay. Bit 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 bit. I need to put some gas in here though. No problems. Um, besides the ignition, I couldn't see anything wrong with it. You know the AC work. You want to buy it? Yeah. I see. All right, it can, it can be a two. You can right there. You can get you an Impala, man. Are right, you back there looking at your car? No, I'm good. Take a picture from the good side. Right there. Take a picture. Yeah, get, get him out the photo. Get it right there. That's see that's what that's how you take the picture right there for you when you're ready to sell it. You go. Um, huh? Nah, nah, just take it from the church. Uh yeah. Guess I'm gonna get a little black paint and just maybe spray. I ain't gonna do that. I'm gonna get get this off of there though. Don't know why they had tape on there, but I don't know why they had tape on there. But they got good tires. Um, I think I actually got extra. I think I got some Chevy hubcaps in my thing. Hopefully, I ain't got a bottle on those hubcaps, but I, those kind of look kind of little stale and dull. I think I might buy some glossy ones. I bought some glossy ones. The Chevy ones, they all, they was, you know, it's got good tires all the way around. Didn't overheat. Didn't run. 
take a picture of those 16. So, yeah, I get the shiny ones. I like the shiny ones to stand out, make the car stand out. So, I this little damage right there. But, you know, you could probably get in there. And if I had, a, like, a rubber mallet, I can get a rubber mallet. But I ain't even about to do that. I'm going to just leave it, leave it alone like that. You know, clean it up. Um, fix the ignition. Oh, yeah, I did stop by the free vacuum. Huh? Nah, not nah, if you don't need to. What you need to be? Nah, you about to bring my keys. Front tire up. You don't hear the front tire up. For what? You see, you see it? Well, it ain't going nowhere. What you gonna drive it on the flood? Who putting the part on my day? Hmm? Who putting the part on my day? Yeah, I was gonna help you. When he gonna help you? Hey, how long? Let me help you. What you gonna drive it on? Nah, he, he got the uh, air pump in his car. Yeah. He's gonna bring my keys in the air pump. Nah, uh, what y'all putting the part on today? It's supposed to. Alright. Yes, I'm gonna get hubs. Um, clean it up. Gotta get some hubcaps with this. It just got freshly detailed. So, gotta get some, some hubs for that. Minute. But it's ready for sale. But let me know in the comment section below. Should I do the course or should I just do like a two times a month like web, web webinar? I think like a webinar would be better. You know, I, mean, I can have I help someplace too. But I feel like an online like a Zoom type webinar would be, would be good. Like this because I know every month stuff changes and people have questions. You know. And then I can have people, I can have other dealers come on and share their experience and help out and as much as possible. You know, so I, I, can, have, I, I can have other dealers, um, other, other people that own businesses and everybody, uh, financial people, and everybody just try to get as like, how the webinar is go. You know, just how that stuff goes. But appreciate everybody for tuning in. If you haven't already, and I like this video, subscribe. Peace. Huh? Alright, don't matter. Well, Alex on the way up here.